Hell, Garrus, you were always ugly. Slap some face paint on there and no one will even notice. <laughs> oh, oh, don't make me laugh. Damn it, my face is barely holding together as it is. Some women find facial scars attractive. Mind you, most of those women are crooked. Frankly, I'm more worried about you, Cerberus Shepard. You remember those sick experiments they were doing? Right now, they're a necessary evil. I need their resources to get this done. I'm fit for duty whenever you need me, Shepard. I'll settle in and see what I can do with the forward batteries. Okay. Let's go talk to uh, Garrus, I guess. Let's see what's up. I think we have possibly some new upgrades as well. We go check those out. Armor upgrades. Tech damage. Squad bonus plus 10% tech da power damage. Uh, cost element zero to do this, though. Metagel. Weapon upgrade. Ship enhancements. Prototypes. Heavy weapon ammo. Heavy bone weave. Requires quite a bit of palladium. Alright, we'll hold off on that then. Okay. Morton, you want to sure. say anything? How can I help? Have you got a minute to talk? Yes, would like that actually. Talked about work earlier. Time with special tasks group studying genophage. It wasn't entirely honest. Lie of omission. Also, other kinds need to clear the air. Mission too important to keep secrets. Work on genophage was more than just study. What was the special tasks group doing with the Krogan genophage? Study at first, as I said, but uncovered surprising data. Krogan population was increasing at faster rate than expected. Krogan were adapting to genophage, overcoming disease. Hmm. Did the Krogan evolve, or did some of their scientists develop a treatment? Krogan scientists? <laughs> Never met Krogan scientists worthy of term. No. Natural evolution. Krogan physiology incredibly durable. Organ redundancy, backup systems, cellular regeneration. Genophage like any other natural hazard. Krogan evolved past it. Maybe they were just having a lucky year. Or a fewer mercs left, meaning more Krogan were left to repopulate. Please, Shepard. Social environmental concerns accounted for. Not an undergraduate. Population spike caused by adaptation to genophage. No other possibility. The genophage was a terrible mistake. It nearly destroyed the Krogan and their culture. Now they have a chance to recover. Naive viewpoint. Krogan too dangerous to allow unchecked birth rate. Look at Krogan rebellions. Personally led a science team. Geneticists, chemists, sociologists, mathematicians. Created new version of genophage. Released it onto Chanka, other Krogan-centric areas. Restabilized Krogan population. Hmm. The genophage was a mistake bordering on a war crime. Recreating it is unforgivable. Don't want me on team? Don't bring me. Can't stay here. Work on collector research. But no apologies. Did what was right. Hope you do the same if necessary. Should get back to work. Talk more later. Next time, tissue synthesis has to compile. Good for free time. Okay. Should we go talk to our good old buddy Garrus? Maybe we should. I think he said he was with the engines, right? Alright, engineering. Let's see if we can find that old bastard. I just heard collectors hit the Ferris Fields colony. Everyone's gone. Shit! We are going to Oh we got your upgrade, base, guys. Commander. We just got those FBA couplings installed. Now we only have to calibrate every week instead of every day. We're thinking about celebrating our newfound free time with some Skillion Five poker. Want to join us? Come on, Kenneth. The commander doesn't want to play cards with grease monkeys like us. Actually, that sounds interesting. Fantastic. I'll get the cards. My Skillion Five's a bit rusty. It'll be easy on the rookie, right? Of course, Commander. It's all friendly. Yeah, right. You've won 500 credits playing Skillion Five. <laughs> be gentle on the rookie. I can't believe we fell for that. It's so worth losing to see you taken down a notch. Beat me up my own game. You're all right, Shepard. What can we do for you, Commander? Nothing. Carry on. Will do, Commander. Alright, where is Garrus? 
He's not down here, right? I thought he said he was going to be in the engine. Oh, you know what? I think I know where he is. I think he's up a level. Actually, unless... Where does this go again? No, he's not back here. It's not where I thought he was anyway. It's in that one compartment. I think. Yeah, uh, OBS just ran... Sometimes it randomly crashes, and that's what happened. It randomly crashed. Sorry about that. So I had to restart it. Every time I restart the stream, uh, Did you hear? Another colony you, YouTube uh, generates a new video stream, so it doesn't Didn't repopulate the same one Twitch there. does. It, yeah. and I, I stream on Twitch as well. Um, so if you watch on Twitch, you wouldn't have to refresh and find the new window and stuff, but it's okay. How may I help you, Commander? I have a present for you, Doc. Sarah's ice brandy? You didn't. <laughs> Thank you. I always regretted not opening that original bottle when I still could. I won't make the same mistake again. Why don't we open this bottle right here, right now, you and me? You crack open the bottle. I'll get the glasses. <laughs> I thought Olenko's biotic display might have broken Jenkins' back, but Jenkins pops up and yells, That was awesome! <laughs> oh, Jenkins. Soldiers like him make the Alliance great. Cerberus lacks the same enthusiasm. Hmm. Okay. Uh, a toast to the Fallen. To Jenkins, to Presley, and to Elenko. May they never be forgotten. Oh, jeez. I'm a little drunk. <laughs> nice. Let's go talk to Garrus drunk. Ugh. Pretty sure he's back here, if I remember correctly. It was years ago that I played, so... Ah, oh, yeah, there he is. Shepard, need me for something? Have you got a minute? Sure. Just checking the weapon systems. You can never be too careful. I thought I'd seen every weapon in the galaxy in our fight against Saren. Mercenary work showed me otherwise. And now Cerberus rebuilds the Normandy with a few upgrades to boot. I wish we'd joined up with them sooner. We haven't joined Cerberus. They're funding our mission. That's all. Relax, Shepard. Just a figure of speech. I can't exactly doubt your judgment. Not after I got my own squad killed. What did your Merc squad do? Didn't sound like you were available for hire. You saw Omega. It was full of thugs kicking the helpless. I formed my team to kick back. We weren't mercenaries. At least nobody was paying us. We made money by taking down slavers, pirates, or gangs that went too far. Doesn't sound like you made any friends with the gangs. I got three separate merc bands to work together to take me down. My manager at CSEC would be impressed. It was simple. We'd hit their shipments, disrupt activities, get under their skin, make them angry. They'd come charging right into our well-prepared kill zone, crossfire and snipers, clean and surgical. They never stood a chance. How'd you end up fighting mercenaries here on Omega? After the Normandy was destroyed, most of us went our separate ways. CSEC asked me back, but I turned them down. Omega was filled with criminals nobody else could touch. And there was no red tape to slow me down. It was a perfect fit. People here needed someone to believe in. Someone to stand up to the local thugs. That explains how you started. How'd you end up with a squad? Not too different from how you formed your squad to fight Saren, actually. You prove that you get things done, and people join up. Mercs who wanted to atone. Security consultants tired of playing by the rules. I gave them hope. And now they're dead. Shows what I know. Tell me about your squad. There were 12 of us, including me. Former military operatives. CSEC agents. The usual. Had a Salarian explosives expert. Pretty sure he'd spent time in the special tasks group. My tech expert was a Batarian, believe it or not. Not the friendliest guy, but he could hack any system ever built. How did those mercenary gangs take down your team? 
was my own damn fault. One of my people betrayed me. A Turian named Sidomis. He drew me away just before the mercs attacked my squad. Then he disappeared. Everyone except me is dead because of him. And because I didn't see it coming. Hmm. I'm not sure I understand. What happened exactly? Sidonis asked for my help on a job. When I got to the meeting point, nobody was there. By the time I got back to our hideout, the mercs had killed all but two of my squad. And they didn't last long. Do you know where Sidonis is now? No. His trail vanishes after he leaves Omega, but I'll keep hunting. I lost my whole team except for Sidonis. One day I'll find him and correct that. Thanks for coming by, Shepard. I've got some things to take care of. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Is there anything else that we've got? Jay is not requests anymore, apparently. Journal assignments. We've completed all this. Oh, we're all at the bottom. Special ingredients. Normandy's cook would appreciate special ingredients to make food better. Most of the supplies he wants are at the Citadel. We go to the crash site. We got all this. Overlord. Superstation of the planet. Up the grid. Oh, yeah, we could go talk to that girl as well. Dossier. The Master Thief. Kazumi Gotu is not the most famous thief in the galaxy. She's the best. Trained in the arts of stealth and infiltration. Rendezvous with Shepard on the Citadel in the Zakira Ward. Okay. He is currently in the Blue Suns camp on Corliss, though his nature and relationship with the mercenary group is unknown. The Warlord. Jack. Okay. Well, let's head back to our uh, space map. Or should we go back to our uh, captain's? Let's go back to our, our uh, captain's cabin. I think we got some new trinkets. Private terminal. Medal of Honor. I know I got some like models and stuff. Are they up there on my shelf? Maybe. What happened to those models I got? Oh yeah, look, they're right there. Nice. We got the Geth ship, I think. We got whatever that thing is. Is that the old Normandy? I can't tell. And then we got the new Normandy. Nice. Let's take off this visor. I can't I can't deal with it. What do we got as far as torsos? Capacitor chest plate. Reduces delay for your shield, starting by ten percent. Keep that. I like the armor. I don't have any fish, do I? I'll get fish eventually. Alright, combat information center. Here we go. Commander, you've received a new message at your private terminal. Oh, have I? Alright. Service Commander Quest. Port cells have been operating the Omega Nebula. I would like you to look into a situation on Lorik, a nearby planet in the farther system. Skin the planet for a base where we believe Ellipse Mercs are holding one of our operatives. You should be able to detect the operative's transmitter. Expect the operative, if the operative is beyond rescue, recover any relevant intel that the Eclipse may have collected. This is a very delicate matter, Shepard. We trust in your discretion. Glad I didn't sign up. From John Whitson. Hey, Area gave me this address. I think I met you at Afterlife on Omega. You stopped me from joining up with those Mercs who were trying to take out Archangel. Man, I was so pissed off at you. I got blind drunk that night, and it was a few days later before I got together enough to check the news vids and saw that almost all those mercs had gotten killed by Archangel. I don't know who you are or if you got out there alive yourself, but thanks. I felt really stupid when I heard about the body count and how I could have been part of it. I'll make the most of that, uh, what you did for me. John Woodson. Things are quiet again. Commander, I wanted to thank you again for saving me from those Batarians. I thought I'd seen the worst of people's anger and fear at Dr. Solis, uh, Solis's clinic. I had no idea how much anger his work was keeping in check, how much bad it was, oh jeez, how bad it really was. If not for you, I'd be dead. Thank you. The clinic is doing well, you got rid of most of the plague, and I've been able to handle the rest without too much trouble. 
Blue Suns keep offering to take over security here. I keep the mechs powered on. I won't make the same mistake twice. Thanks, Daniel. Good. And what do you have to say, Kelly? How is our newest Turian crew member doing? His injuries looked painful. He's a soldier. It'll take a lot more than that to keep him down. There's something about him. I just want to hold him close and whisper, it will be alright. I can use that. Uh, you are in aliens. Are you attracted to other species? Well, part of my job is predicting the motives and feelings of humans and aliens. Intimacy brings understanding. And passion is nice wherever you find it. Character matters, not race or gender. Anything else, Commander? Mm, that's correct. Is there anything I should know? Nothing right now. Anything else, Commander? Do you have a moment to talk? I always have time for you, Commander. Mm, okay. I better go. Okay. Maybe we'll talk later. Maybe. Alright. Well, anyways, I think this is probably a good uh, place to stop for tonight. So thanks for watching, guys. Make sure you hit the follow button, hit the subscribe button if you're on YouTube. And I will see you guys next time. Bye-bye!